La Sagrada Familia. For its origins, foundation, and purpose, the Sagrada Familia is a one-of-a-kind temple. The initiative was promoted by the people for the people. Thanks to the genius architect Antony God's labor, the temple in Barcelona has been under construction for five generations. The basilica is still being built today, more than 135 years after the cornerstone was laid. Original design for the Sagrada Familia by diocesan architect Francisco de Paula del Villa. Incorporating neo-Gothic elements such as ogival windows, buttresses, flying buttresses, and a pointed bell tower, following the prevailing rules of the time. Due to technical differences over material costs, this architect was replaced by Anthony God, a rising star in the industry, who steered the project in a new direction transforming it into an ambitious design for the church of the future. The foundations of Sagrada Familia date back to 1866, when a group of St. Joseph followers decided to build a temple in his honor. On March 19, 1882, the Feast of San Jose. The first stone was put in the midst of a 12,000 square meter plot of ground. The 18 towers are each named after a biblical character, and their scale reflects this. The apostles will be represented by 12 of them, the evangelists by 4, the Virgin Mary by 1. And Jesus Christ will be represented by the highest of them all, which will be crowned by a cross reaching a height of 172 meters. The Junta Constructora del Temple Expiatri de la Sagrada Familia is a religious foundation that is private, non-profit, and independent. Its mission is to construct, preserve, and restore the expiatory temple of the Sagrada Familia, which was founded by Josep Maria Bocabella and planned by Antony God on a block of property bordered by Mallorca, Marina, Provenza, and Sardinia streets. The Sagrada Familia is a prominent example of Antony God's unique style, which combines aspects of Art Nouveau, Catalan modernism, and Spanish late Gothic design. God's design is heavily influenced by nature, both in terms of symbolism and the usage of organic shapes and patterns. God had been working on the Templo Expiatorio de la Sagrada Familia for 43 years when he died. Abruptly in 1926 at the age of 73, struck down by a tram on a busy Barcelona street. After 144 years of building, the Sagrada Familia in Spain is set to be finished in 2026. On the 100th anniversary of Antony Gaudi's, the original architect, death, the Sagrada Familia will have 18 towers when it is finished, with the largest soaring 564 feet into the sky. Donations and arms have long been used to pay the basilica's construction. Because the construction of La Sagrada Familia was not backed by either government or church, finances, it was given the term expiatory temple. It was built with the help of private donors in the early stages. The Sagrada Familia is Barcelona's most popular tourist destination, with over 4.7 million visitors in 2019. Park Gal and the FC Barcelona Museum were the next stops. The Sagrada Familia is the most well-known monument in one of Europe's most popular towns. Visiting the Sagrada Familia is well worth it. And it's no surprise that hundreds of tourists do so every day. Hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching all our videos.